bedroom and cars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. You didn't cast it aside. I fought you and drove your spirit into hiding. I had already shifted my focus to Sukul many centuries before your victory here. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. This story sounds too good to pass up. Back in my SIS days, I may have blown up a prototype Sith warship. Lorman was the deputy commander. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Did you ever imagine the Sith would negotiate with a Jedi? I hope you're able to move beyond your prejudice. In the past, arrogance would have blinded us to our flaws. Now we understand admitting weakness is the first step in eliminating it. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. I can handle myself if she tries anything. Will you two be okay if I leave you with Lorman? It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. Sith who do not approve of the alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Taking her down is all that matters. I welcome any help I can get. This does not end with Valen. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. I want nothing to do with the throne. You hardly have a choice. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast. Bail out! Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. Lorman's behind this. I know it. Lorman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming.
forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. This doesn't need to end with violence. Violence is the Geno Harridan style. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. The beacon destroyed, comm signal still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. The Geno Harridan must have a camp nearby. We can ride out the storm there. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Look at this as an adventure. That is not reassuring. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what he started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. I suppose a shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh, that Republic snake. Suresh is no longer in charge of the Republic. True. But intelligence believes she still holds significant power. Into the temple! I'm sure there's another way out. You've got a pretty positive attitude about all this. Being Empress of the Sith and an Optimist aren't mutually exclusive. Reports from Drome and Cass claim the Outlander is dead. No. 
father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious outlander is missing. Odessan is not the target. The looted tomb of another Sith Lord. I once thought these ancient temples held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. Why is it that all Sith believe they can live forever? Do not mistake me for the fools who seek immortality out of blind ego. Emperor of the Sith was my first face, but it is merely one of many I have worn. And what about the face you wear now? I found Valkorion centuries ago. He was a great warrior, a champion of ancient Zakul. It was only natural I hollow him out to use as my vessel. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. I see plenty of flaws in Zakul. The glory of the Eternal Empire has been tainted by my children. But it can be restored. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Baywan, now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here, to Odessan. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Minister Lawman warned us you might sneak off. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. Wouldn't want to upset your new boss, would you, Lorman? It's Minister Lorman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. To Suresh? You're just a lackey. She'll turn on you the first chance she gets. The Alliance Commander is right. But if you surrender now and beg for mercy, I might let you live. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. Sounds like you had some excitement on your end. Nothing we couldn't handle. It's good to hear your voice.
I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. Suresh is behind this. Has she attempted to reach you? She's done more than that. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? It's time to embrace new methods, Empress. Be merciful, and you'll have a loyal servant for life. Unsatisfying, but I will try it your way. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. I assume you know everything, then. I don't understand. Why go through all this? Are you working for Valen? I want to destroy Valen, and you're not fit to lead the Alliance. I am. I saw an opportunity, and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. That's the difference between us. You get to live, though you'll be in an Alliance prison for a long, long time. Take her away. You have no idea how happy I am. Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. I apologize for everything on Droman Cuss, but I still believe we should unite your people with mine. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Enough. If this is going to work, we all need to trust each other. I, uh, right. Sorry, Commander. I hope to prove you can count on the Empire. I look forward to working with you. the gravestone. We got your back, Radala. You okay? I've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. <laughs> 